like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Medical masks like this one cannot protect against the new coronavirus when used alone. When you wear them, you must combine with hand hygiene and other preventive measures. WHO only recommends the use of masks in specific cases. If you have cough, fever, and difficulty breathing, you should wear a mask and seek medical care. If you do not have these symptoms, you do not have to wear masks because there is no evidence that they protect people who are not sick. However, if you are healthy, but you are taking care of a person who may be infected with the new coronavirus, then you should wear a mask whenever you are in the same room with that person. And remember, if you choose to wear a mask, use it and discard it properly, and clean your hands with alcohol hand rub or soap and water. For more information on mask use, other preventive measures, and the new coronavirus, check WHO website at who.int. Thank you. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Design Station. I am here with a special video on 3D printing of the personal antimicrobial face mask in Ultimacker using the copper 3D filament. The face mask model was designed by Esteban Ruiz Tagle and we are going to print this model. The following video will show you the steps involved in setting the model in the Cura software followed by 3D printing, so let's get started. Begin by loading the 3D model of face mask in the Cura software. If the model is textured in the following manner, it means it has to be arranged properly in the build plate. Use T to position the model in the build plate. For the medical purpose we prefer the copper 3D PLA filament. Set a layer height of 0.1 mm and an infill of 25% for the model. Most important is to set the print speed to 45 mm per second. Click on the slice option, it shows us how much time it takes for the 3D printing and how much filament is consumed. Save the G code into the USB after slicing is done and plug into the Ultimacker 3 3D printer for the printing to begin.
like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.